most of you have been reaching out to me on instagram telling me leticia i'm tired of these dating apps leticia i just feel like quitting leticia this and that oh my god it's been really a lot yes but in today's video i'm gonna share with you ways on how to find love besides dating apps because i realized that most of you have put so much energy and focus on dating apps the harsh truth is that dating apps are not for everyone mm -hmm. i know that might upset you but that's the honest truth i have seen very many interracial couples who didn't meet on dating apps but on other social media platforms like facebook instagram tiktok and other social media platforms but today i'm not going to talk about how to meet a partner online i'm only going to focus on other ways on how to meet your partner besides online or dating apps i hope you find this video helpful and i hope you're going to watch this video up to the end especially if you are someone out there searching for love So where are these guys these guys are everywhere <laughs> yes they are everywhere by the way before i get fully in today's topic there is something i want to bring up uh there is some girl i was chatting with on um on instagram and she told me about her challenges uh of finding love on dating apps and whatever and um we discussed and i asked her some questions you know one of the questions i asked her was that why is she looking for love i mean what is her intention of finding love you know um she told me oh leticia uh, there is this friend of mine she just got married a german guy oh they did an expensive wedding and introduction and oh my god i want that life and then she also told me that i see you guys you know um your men are doing a lot for you i also want an international guy i was like what is that the only reason you are searching for love she was like yes i was like okay uh is that all you wanted us to talk about she was like yeah um in my head i thought that maybe there are other people who are like her some people are searching for love for the wrong reasons so please if you are searching for love just because you've seen your friend getting married because you've seen whatever is happening on social media then you are searching for love for the wrong reasons make sure you are searching for love because you want someone to spend the rest of your life with someone to start a family with someone you you know someone you want to have kids with in the future for the right reasons because at the end of the day if you are lucky enough to find that person that relationship won't last because at the end of the day you won't know what it means to be in a committed relationship you won't know what to do to keep that relationship you know because you loved for the wrong reasons because you'll have high expectations that oh leticia's man did this for her and you start putting that man on pressure asking him to provide things that you saw other men doing for their ladies and if you don't get what you are expecting then you might start acting weird in that relationship and that might end the relationship so make sure if you are ready to find love you are absolutely ready okay yes i just felt like i should tell you about this i want you to ask yourself what's my lifestyle right now are you this person who comes from work and goes to home like you don't talk to anybody you don't even go out hang out with friends you have the same circle of friends like since january to december you have the same circle of friends you've not even met any new friend are you that kind of a person i know you have the right answers for that question i know most of you have busy schedules you know but when you are someone who's trying to find love then that lifestyle will not favor you here's what i would advise you uh once in a while when you come from work let's say you don't have like a tiresome day go have some coffee somewhere at a cafe 
let's say that you do shopping uh, at a certain supermarket change and go to a different supermarket you know go to different shopping malls on the weekend you know attend conferences go to church go to museums go to big hotels big restaurants don't just come from work and then reach home and then you start tapping your phone your busy on dating apps and you think okay at least i'm finding love online no please try other ways if you've tried dating apps and you've not seen results for a while try other ways because they, they are interracial couples who met um at the supermarket shopping malls not every interracial couple meets on a dating app okay so please make sure you change your lifestyle you know take yourself out you know and also what you do when you reach to those places matters too yes are you this person who reaches at a cafe or anywhere or at the party anywhere it doesn't matter where you are do you just get busy on your phone like you don't want to talk to anybody you don't want to look around and smile like do you just be on your phone busy tapping like if you are that kind of a person then you'll block uh yourself from people who would have reached out to you and interact with you right yeah look around smile i'm not i'm not saying like you just you should smile like like this all the time no that's not what i'm talking about i mean like let your face look welcoming you know yes don't reach at the party don't reach at, uh, at the conference anywhere and you stay around the same circle of friends go greet other people say hello to them interact you know yes make that first move don't wait for people to, to reach out to you mm -hmm. i know sometimes uh, maybe you've gone like um uh, if you go like at a cafe or anywhere and a guy reaches out to you and uh, maybe he wants to interact with you and uh, and you are this person who wants to play hard to get if you are this person who still has this thing of like i'm a girl i have to play hard to get my dear you'll stay single forever because if you show a guy that you're not interested he won't understand that you are playing hard to get He'll just leave you. He'll think that, oh, he's, she's not interested in me. If you are genuinely not interested in that guy, just be honest. Eh? Don't waste your time and his time as well. Just make it short. But if you're interested in that guy and he's trying to get to know you, don't play hard to get, please. Just give him time. Ask him questions. Get to know each other. And when you guys exchange contacts, you can get in touch like that. But what I'm saying is that don't be busy on your phone when you are out there and don't stay in the same place if you've gone out with friends don't stay around the same friends at least every time you get an opportunity to go out make a new friend make one or two friends you know yeah and um sometimes you never know the connections that friend has sometimes you never know the opportunities that might come with that stranger you just said hello to so as long as you get out there do something you know yes interact <laughs> and in these big restaurants and hotels and these big shopping malls it's where most international men are so please try those places and i'm very sure um you might find a great partner there be nice to people interact with people be friendly you know don't so don't be so busy on your phone you know and please as you go out there look good smell good you know look polished <laughs> yes and uh, when i talk about looking good i'm not talking about like dressing to kill putting on expensive clothes designer clothes that's not what i'm talking about you can dress in a simple way but you know as long as you are comfortable in what you are wearing you know you are good to go but make sure you look good okay as a lady you have to look good right ask yourself what would you do in the next three months that is different from what you are doing now you know just like i said if you keep doing the same things then you'll keep getting the same results as a person you know what you need to change in the next three months that is different from what you are doing right now because i don't know your lifestyle i don't know anything about you but please whatever you're doing is the reason why you are not getting the results 
change your lifestyle, try new things, make new friends, you know, try different places, try different activities, okay? And please don't get me wrong. I'm not encouraging you to delete your dating apps, no? Keep trying dating apps, yes. Also, um, dating apps need an investment. You know, they need time. You need to be active, you know? So the same energy you put on dating apps to find love, that should be the same energy you put in when you are searching for love offline, when you are out there. This is 2024, okay? So you need to come up with new ideas, new better ways of finding love. Don't just focus on one thing. That is why you'll be stressed, you you lose hope, you feel like it's, it will never work for you. No, try other ways. You should also be active on other social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. You know, there are many ways of meeting a partner. So I hope this video was helpful. If you have any questions uh, regarding this video, feel free to ask me in the comment section. And if you have anything that you want me to share on this channel, you can also feel free to let me in the comment section. I love reading your comments. I love interacting with you guys. So if you are still watching this video, I'm sure you found it helpful and I'm sure you loved it. Make sure you subscribe as a way of appreciating me. Like this video, share it to anyone that you know that might need it. And uh, see you in the next one. Mwah. Bye.